A lesser known locality uh, in South Africa, the, the Frieda Falle deposit. General term for these would be the Orange River quartzes, of course, uh, uh, hailing from or provenance being the, the various sides of the Orange River, the one facing, well, the one on the Namibian side and the one on the South African side. In this case, the deposit lies between uh, Rimfos Mark, a deposit very famous for the uh, uh, apple green fluorites, which one finds there. Also some lovely quartzes from there actually. And as we go down towards Pofader site, about 50 kilos outside uh, uh, Rimfos Mark, we have a little farm, Freda's Filet, uh, not to be mistaken for the Freda Filet in the Western Cape, around about Swellendam. And there we have interesting milky quartz associated with uh, 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 what appears to be chloride included quartz and then on some of these the color is often going almost going into the hep epidote which is very odd to me I don't know if if uh, epidote replaces quartz I wouldn't be surprised of the other way around but this was generally initially quartz now on this particular side I, I often think we may be looking at maybe some traces of even some uh, 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 copper related because there's an almost a malachite green on this side uh, which would of course be some chalcedony most likely from this deposit all the way from South Africa very very interesting material rather aesthetic too uh, this this side of course would be for me the, the, the point of display but please note, I, I, I look at it as a collector. From an aesthetic uh, display point of view, perhaps at this angle. Let's give it a bit of light. Uh, that's a pretty accurate indication of the color.